Hello everyone, today we are going to review the new release of the ATR bar color indicator. This is this indicator that we can see on this chart and as we saw on previous videos it is an improvement of the super trend. Between some of the new features we have the option now to select the type of line used for these trend lines. When the market breaks these trend lines, we have a change on the trend from long to short. On super trend, we only have two states: or we are going long, or we are short, or we are going short. On the eighter bar color, we have an additional state, neutral that we can see on these yellow bars. On the neutral state, we create a pivot of user-defined strength in number of bars, and the market needs to break this new pivot to change the trend again. We can see some examples like here, or even here where we avoid a short loser signal because the, the pivot created is never broken. This on super trend will be a short loser. These trend lines are proportional to the volatility of the market. They use the ATR of the last n number of bars. We can control the length of the ATR and we multiply this by a multiplier and we displace that from a user defined line. The default setting for the previous version was an HMA, it was fixed. To understand how, how it works, we can add an HMA with the same period as we have on the smooth setting and we can see that the distance from the trend line to the HMA is equal but it, it never goes down on an uptrend it, it is always going to the upside only improving when we have a higher high until the market breaks to the downside. Th this line can be now changed as we are able to do it on super trend and now we can use any other line. For example, one of the most used is the high low where we just look at the higher high made and always keep updating to the best high made so never going down until the market breaks to the downside another option is using the close instead of the high and low and now on this case we are following the higher close for each bar. For example, this bar has a high, but we are only following the close for each bar. Like on this example, the line is always following the, the best close for each bar. We can select a lot of lines. Let's go back to the HMA. And another new feature is the option to decrease the pivot strength to make it even zero. If we decrease the size of the strength, let's say for example only one bar 
then we can see that the pivot is always the low of the last bar so we get a breakout when we have a lower low and if we use zero we don't have neutral zone and we get the same as on a standard super trend so with the new ATR bar color we have also the option to work as a super trend the new feature also is the option to to have the trend ported to another indicator for example markers or market analyzer trend now is uh, has three options going up going down or neutral so if we enable this option which is also present on the last version of super trend we get a new line with three possible values minus one plus one or zero to avoid this scale problem we can disable the auto scale and now if, if we press the middle button of the mouse we can see that we have a new parameter with the value of the trend one for an uptrend minus one for a downtrend and zero for yellow bars this value can be used to filter markers and also on market analyzer if we add a market analyzer window we can add a column with this indicator and if we set the op mode to 1 then we have available the new plot with the trend value so now we have the trend for all the instruments on the market analyzer for example for crude oil of January the current trend is 1 so it is trending up we can choose any title on the column like for example trend and we can also select any time frame not only the one that we have on the chart if we want to use the trend of the ITR bar color to filter on markers we only need to use the copy indicator we assign a name for the trend and on the input series we place the ATR bar color indicator I was using a multiplier of 4 a pivot strength of 16 bars we need to set the operation mode to 1 so we have the trend the smoothing is 30 the period of the HMA and the line that we want to copy is the trend We, we can show this on bar format or dot format I will choose a dot format and now we have copied the trend into a variable uh, into a markers variable this is with a trend of 0 all the uptrend is with plus 1 having this copied into a variable it can be used to filter any trace setup hope this video has been useful for you and if you have any question please post below this video thank you everyone bye bye